podés tener el mejor tabaco, la mejor tierra, el mejor clima, pero si no tenés el talento humano correcto, las personas que tengan una calidad de vida y que piensen diferente, no vas a tener un producto con buena calidad. Nosotros decidimos lo que queremos ser en la vida. Yo soy el que escribo mi propia historia. Ese es el programa que se ha desarrollado dentro de Plasencia. Sin esta persona nada es posible. Sounds Beats, Placencia Farm Tour. He's going to show you the, the, the process of making the, the vermicompost process. Oh, okay. So this is where it all starts. Mm -hmm. all, all the cigars you make start right here. You can oh cook an gosh. egg. Yeah, you could fry an egg in there. Uh -huh. It's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think it would be like that hot. It smells beautiful. Debe de tener apariencia de tierra con, con que salga olfato. Mm -hmm. yeah, que olfato sea bosque. You smell it? It smells like an Oregon forest mm -hmm. <laughs> from where I'm from. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That is a organic fertilizer for the organic cigars. And we're using two for the conventional tobacco. It starts here. And mm -hmm. you were saying that Pacencia is the only company that you're aware of that's doing this uh, organic process, yes. right? This working with the temperature. So the various sources that you're using provide various heat levels depending on what's in it? Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. okay. Entre los materiales café utilizamos vena de tabaco. También podemos usar cartón. Okay. Reciclando, recicle. We recycling this to, to make a good compost. It's just amazing to see the amount of thought and care that goes into this process. Yes. All the way to the end of the process. Yes, look at that. Oh my gosh. It's incredible how many worms. Yeah. Wow. So it's it, all this great, all this fertilizer is a lot very alive yes every three days they bring more more food more food for the worms and for, dos meses. for for two months they look so happy yeah they're yeah. having this is the best life this is the best case scenario for worm culture for sure we we can move this all the the, the material yeah because it's ready to to put it in that uh, that table okay to, to clean it Oh, so you clean this all up mm -hmm. after this process. Mm -hmm. Wow. Everything is so carefully yeah. uh, calculated. Step by step. Yeah, step, step by, by step. step. Yeah. Look at that. This is the final yeah, product. Oh. Can, I, can I smell it? Yeah. The organic fertilizer ready for the organic tobacco. But there's a cycle to it because you're also using tobacco in the fertilizer. So it's, it's really interesting. I had no idea. So this becomes this. Yes, sir. Yes. I have, I had never seen the flowers, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Because this is shade grown tobacco for wrapper, and this one is sun grown tobacco for filler. So shade grown tobacco different. grows larger? Or? Yes, okay. larger, yes. Wow. You have to walk. <laughs> it's like a completely different environment in here. It's like 10 degrees cooler. Wow. I think the thing that people don't understand about um, tobacco leaves is uh, the elasticity like it mm -hmm. it stretches like a piece of cellophane mm -hmm. people don't understand that and that's why people are able to roll cigars into such unique shapes is it's not a brittle leaf like what most people think they see on a tree you touch it and it breaks like yeah this is like yeah. leathery and stretchy and durable yeah this is helped to have a, a, a thinner leaves oh so the shade grown is th uh, shade grown is thinner thinner because oh, because okay. the yeah. That's why we're putting this to, to have a thinner lips, thinner veins, and it's going to have a, a, a better uh, wrapper for the cigars. We have, a, for example, the lips from the foot yeah. is, is thinner, Yeah. the medium texture, yeah. and, uh, and the top, we have a thicker lips because the sun. Yeah. And that's why we separate the tobacco seco, viso, and ligero in the plant. It's, it's the difference uh, between uh, here in Esali and uh, Jalapa, for example, is it's a uh, sandy soil. Okay. Sandy soil, and you can see clay yeah. soil. It's more. Yeah. Uh, you, can make that's pottery, why, you can make pottery out of that. We can make some. Look at that. That's why we can lugs. have a, a, a more strength in the in the in the tobacco from Esali. 
Okay. More than, more than Jalapa. Because the soil because is much soil. richer. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what's the amount of time between the time you plant the tobacco plant and it's rolled into a cigar? For our Placencia brand, it takes more time because we age in the tobacco for uh, five to almost 10 years from the seed to the cigars in the box. We we have a 537 step in the in all the process, hand, hand by hand, yes. hand by hand, yeah. from the seed to the cigar in the box. 500, 500, 500, 537, 537 steps. steps, hand by hand, because all the all the process is by hand, no machine, nothing, yeah. all by hand. Imagine that. It's unbelievable. People don't understand that they're smoking a 14-year-old process that like has all these beautiful souls working on it all the way through. That's unbelievable. Come in here and then we're gonna see the, how to put in the, the curing barn. Let's gonna take a look here. Aquí están, verdad? Can I go uh, under here? Yeah, yeah. Okay. We bring the tobacco here. And then we put in this stick, and then we put in in, in every section to start the, oh, the yeah. curing process. And how long will these typically be in here? Here like is this, the this time, step of the process. It, is, it is depend on the, the what the variety of this tobacco. 50 days, okay. 60 days, something like that. We, we is the process of the curing okay. tobacco. And they just sew they like a single uh, stitch through it. Mm -hmm. Okay. In every stick. Yeah. Uh, 14 pairs of leaves. Okay. But they put in it with the with the vein uh -huh. to protect the, 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 the face of the leaves. Every every stick that they fill is a, has a cost. So it's per piece that you um, fill it up in, you, in the you, stick. You, you, you get paid. Yes. Is there, okay. So there's an incentive to do a good job and to work fast and hard. Yeah. That's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Cuba is not like that. Melon here is very strong. Mm -hmm. My my yeah. asthma is having a hard time with it. It's so, it's wait till you get in there. Oh yeah, you smell that? Whoa, yeah. It's the natural ammonia of the tobacco. Wow. The fermentation process. I got like a head change when I walked in here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> mm, smell sweet. Oh Take wow. A look and touch it and uh, you can see here, this is wrapper. So everything in here is just. Wrapper. Just wrapper. wrapper. Not, no filler, no binder, no nothing. filler. Okay. Filler is in another, another place. Okay. Wow. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of wrapper. <laughs> yeah. 160,000 pounds of wrapper here. For a, a thousand cigars, yeah. we need a 10. 10, 10, 10, pounds. 10, 10 pounds. And we put it in the center of the villon, this thermometer, to check in every day the temperature. When the temperature is going to be at 110, we, the pilon said that we need to, to rotate it. We put in this one to the top and this one to the, to the floor to have an even fermentation of all the tobacco. You can see here they, they spread a little bit of humidity, oxygen. This take uh, almost two years, it depends on the texture of the tobacco. This area, this is the selection area that we separate the tobacco by texture. And uh, we separate seco, we separate the viso, and we separate ligero texture. That is uh, seco means uh, thinner leaves, viso medium texture, and ligero is the thicker leaves. That is has some more flavor, more strength. The second one is quality. We separate the wrapper, the, the binder, and the filler. The third one is colors, because we have different colors in the cigars. We separate the lightest wrapper, the medium, and the darker wrapper. Mm -hmm. 
Let's continue. Bueno, venía con los pilotos porque estaba... Bueno. Okay, let's take a look of the special room. This is our cab of tobacco. Feel the difference here, no yeah. ammoniac. No, Just... the smell is completely different. Mm -hmm. And this is all, ce the walls are all uh, cedar lined. Cedar wool uh, yeah. from, uh, we're recycling the old, wo old oh, cool. boxes. Oh, so and this is all here. boxes? It's Repurposed combined boxes? With the tobacco. Yeah, and you can see here the, the, the date. This uh, bale is from uh, 2012. You can see here, Ligero from Jalapa, 2012 too. Oh, wow, that'll be a good one. So this is the room. This is the mother load. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. We're gonna open a bale to, to you smell it. Uh, oh, wow. The special. Open it. Wow, wow. Mm -hmm. It's incredible. I wish my house smelled like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like uh, chocolate. Yeah, yeah, like cacao, chocolate, a little pepper. When I feel that. Oh, dark chocolate. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh my God. Chocolate, yeah, this is chocolate. For, yeah. for, um, you feel? Yeah. And you see all the process is important yes. in every step yes. to have this special tobacco. Okay, here they working in pairs. Okay, yeah. The the rolera and the bonchero, they, they working in pairs. Yeah. He's the bonchero that he make the all the fillers inside of the cigar. And then they, the rollera, he put in the dress of the cigar. They're all perfect. Amazing. It's a work of art. Mm -hmm. This is all art. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love I love the way that you speak of the soul of each the soul. person. All these souls. Yes. Making a. You start with the hands. Yeah. And we bring the this special to God. Yes. You see, always putting our soul in everything we do. Yes. In the 557 step we put in the soul in everything no es sencillamente concentrado en hacer un puro de buena calidad nosotros lo que hacemos en placencia es que cambiamos forma de pensar cambiamos a la llevamos a la gente a pensar diferente cambiamos mundo cambiamos corazones y llevamos un producto con la mejor calidad 100% hecho a mano para degustar, para celebrar, para compartir y para pasar un momento en familia y pasar totalmente feliz. Eso es lo que hacemos nosotros en Plasencia aquí. Amamos lo que hacemos, amamos nuestro trabajo y todas las personas que están acá en Plasencia. Eso es lo que hacemos en Plasencia.
don't like Disneyland, Vern. This is my Disneyland. <laughs> we are at my Disneyland. <laughs> Dave's Disneyland, that's the name of our show. <laughs>